Okay, uh, this is mechanism four, and I'll just jump right into it. Um, let's see. For the final product, all we're going to have to do is connect this oxygen right over here. So let me get my hydrolytic function, grab one of those bonds, hit arrange. And that should be it. I think for the most part in this lesson, there's maybe a max of two movements. Uh, not too bad. Okay, so this is the fourth intermediate. This is when we remove one of these hydrogens and place it on, um, I believe, this carbon that we'll be taking the double bond off of. So I'm going to remove one of, that, one of those bonds and release the electrons to the nitrogen. And then I see that this octet for carbon is not complete. So I'll drag one of these hydrogens out here, hit arrange. And now it looks good. Let me roll it around so you guys can see it. So all these octet rules are, are satisfied. Uh, nitrogen has a lone pair. This remains just with one hydrogen. And now this compound here, there's only two hydrogens on it. So that's for the fourth intermediate. And of course, like we did before, um, just write down the different intermediates in the notebook. It's really helpful. Okay, so for the first intermediate, we're going to be connecting these two molecules. I'm going to be connecting the carbon to the nitrogen with this single bond. But first, I'm going to release these electrons to the oxygen. So... Okay, now it's got three lone pairs, and now I'm going to connect this lone pair to carbon. Hit arrange. Now I'll roll it around so you can see it different. So this is still connected to the carbon, the oxygen. Um, I, don't, I don't think that comes off till the third intermediate. And this, I, I don't touch this until um, I think the final or the fourth. Okay, yeah, I don't touch this till the fourth. I had to think about it. Okay, the second intermediate. So this is showing the first, which we just did. And the second is when we take this hydrogen and place it on the oxygen. So very simple. I'm going to use one of these bonds to grab that. And I'm going to zoom in a little bit so it'll be easier. I'm going to try to release these electrons to the nitrogen. Perfect. Arrange. Roll. Okay. So I'm trying to move it around so you guys can see it. This hasn't been touched yet. And all I did was um, move that hydrogen to the oxygen. I think this will be taken off in the next one, in the third intermediate, if we haven't done that yet. Okay, so the third intermediate is very simple. We're just going to take off that hydroxy molecule. And I'm going to roll it around and make sure everything's fine. Okay, everything looks good. Um, this carbon doesn't have a full octet, but that's how the third intermediate is going to look, because in the fourth intermediate is when we take 
this hydrogen out from here and place it onto the carbon. Um, and also when it's asking you for the fourth intermediate, it'll show as a double bond. I don't want to do a double bond because of the cyclic pi bonds, so I'm going to leave it as is. But this will be your third intermediate. Zero. Okay, I think that's it. Yep, not too bad. And good luck.